Greetings, Dennis Daniels here. Uh, this is my continuing adventure with getting a USB drive to set as permanent storage. I have an iMation 128, and if you've seen the other videos, <coughs> uh, I've been trying to get the permissions changed. I just went in as root to change the perms, and you'll see right here, let's close that, Alt F4, and you can see I'm in the KDE uh, desktop environment. Let's move that down a little bit. That's the Explorer. And let's see if I can get this to be a little larger for us. Fill the screen. Okay. It's a little better, huh? Now, uh, you can see over here that I've already got a session started. And let's click on it and bring it to the front. There it is. Okay. So, um, LS. You can see SDA1 is, is a config file, so when I cat it, SDA1 comes up as a text file. That's fine. figured that's how Nopix handles it. Uh, but when I go into CD mount, SD, uh, CD mount, ooh, LS, bring that up a little bit. Okay, so auto, CD-ROM, floppy, HDA, SDA1, and SDB1. So let's CD, SDA, LS, Boston found. Uh, let's see, DF. Uh, DF, A. Uh, used, available, it doesn't give me perms. How do I get the perms up here? Um, D, okay, man, DF. Let's see if it pulls up the man. I want to see if I can get the perms up for SDA. That's interesting. Look, SDBA, SDA, and SDB both look very similar. Okay. I'll do a search for perms. Okay, per. Oh, escape that. Q. Oh, DF. Um, see, that's interesting. I've got two on SDB1 and, oh, it's at Union FS. Now, that's what I don't understand. It says it's mounted. The file system. Does that mean I have to go in through Union FS in order to access the file? See, okay, LS, there's nothing in there. LS, AL, says that root owns it. That's where I'm at. I'm at root. So if I CP off the desktop, uh, Okay, Control Shift N. That should give me a new terminal. It does. Okay, so LS. Any day. See, I Control Shifted N, and it created a. Let's pull that up. A new terminal. There it is. So uh, I want to copy this. Make sure I'm in the right place. Okay, so I'm going to copy from. Let's see, shift tab, is that going to take me? Nope. Control tab, nope. Control tab taking me in between the different desktops. Uh, shift tab doesn't do anything in terms of getting me into the shells, different shells. Control tab doesn't do it. Alt tab. Alt tab is interesting. Alt arrow, rather, that doesn't do it. Um, alt home, that doesn't do it either. Backspace. I have to click. All right, so I click and ls. So let's go to the desk. Let's go to the root. Hmm. CD ls. Okay, CD desktop. CD Nopix desktop. So it's CP Nopix. All right, CP Nopix. Desk 
Nobix home desktop. Nothing in the home directory, so where is my desktop? Take it back here. Nopix. CD K N O K N O P L S. Okay, Nopix CD home ls nothing in home okay so that's not where it is where's the desktop cd dot dot cd user ls ls cd dot dot go back ls where's my desktop that's interesting Nopix home. Where's my desktop? CD LS. Looking for desktop. CD home. That's not it. Or maybe it is. CD Nopix LS. There it is. Okay, so PWD, pull up the whole path. Alright, home Nopix. There it is. So, uh, CP home Nopix desktop history dot text, and now I'm going to copy it here. Dot dot. That should do it. Hey, LS didn't work. Uh, okay, so I'll do it again and CP. Now we'll put the full path. Hmm. What is my full path? PWD. There's my full path. Okay, so mount SDA1. Read only file system. Yeah. It's a read only file system. Okay, same problem. Uh, different a tactic. Don't know why I can't get SDA1 to be read, uh, to be anything other than read only. Let's go back out. CD dot dot LS uh, LL. Does that work? Shows owned by root. And SDB1, I have read write on everything, including execute. So let's go to execute uh, SDB1. Can I create regular file? Read only file system. Well, there it is. Even with read and write permissions, which you can see right here. Um, it's not working. I can't write to that flash drive. So let's grab the history of this. History. Oh, and um, let's copy this. Let's see if I can get the whole thing. Can. Okay. And copy. And I'll paste it over here paste file save as control s um, again thank you people um, I want to thank you for your time uh, this has been um, fun almost my name is Dennis Daniels and thank you and happy computing